Welcome all Indigo League Legends and your Miami Infernates fans. This is your boy Dummy Mar here week week two on the Indigo League of Legends versus my boy Roshi. This guy has a fantabulous team and um I'm not gonna lie, I was very scared for this match. Um I had momentum when I won against a um, mini munch. And I hope I gain even more momentum in this match. So this week I brought um Oh let me pull up my sets here while you guys are seeing that. Sorry. Uh Alright, so we had Crackle the Thunderous Nasty Plus Substitute Thunderbolt T Wave. This thing runs house and all his members. All I have to do is get rid of M Mammal Swine. And uh, this thing kills everything. My next Pokemon is Ken Gyarados. Um, the Substitute Dragon Dance set. With Waterfall and Ice Fang. Um, this thing will tear shreds to his team. Um, but if you bring if he brought the Blastoise, then uh, Blastoise walls my entire set. Luckily in this match he didn't. Next up we got Mega Tyranitar with Stone Edge, Crunch, Avalanche, and Earthquake. Um Avalanche just for those um those dragon types. Since uh, Avalanche does get boosted to one base one twenty attack. Next up we got Choice Scarf Special Victini with Blue Flare, Psy Shark, Gallade, and Thunderbolt. Psy Shock mainly for the Chansey. And Victini, when it's special, does a lot of damage. Next up, we got a more defensive Hippodon set with Slack Off Toxic, Stealth Rock, and Roar. This thing stalls out a lot of things. Um, can eat up hits from the Verizion. So far and so forth. And then we got the Blissey with its leftovers. Natural Cure, Seismic Toss, Thunder Wave, Soft Void, and Aromatherapy. Now, a few key things. This has been a long match. And, uh, his team is so bulky. Like, it's so crazy. Like, more threat is a Metal Swine and a possibly Mega Scizor. And, uh, for me, my main lead has to be Gyarados, so I can just set up a Dragon Dance. Because he might go with Mammal Swine's, um, set up his rocks. And I could just set up. That could be Unwork of Fable, if if I do say so. The Unwork of Fable does wall my Gyarados. So, uh, let's see what has happened. Alright, so I... I do predict him to lead off with the uh, Mammal Swine, but he goes to Rotom Wash as I set up the substitute. Here I was anticipating some type of electric moves, just so for him to get off my sub. But he goes for Flight, and I'm here like, so he, this must be a screen's Rotom. Um, I go to Exad, he goes up to Pacha. Uh, here, I'm not sure what he was trying to predict, but, well, he predicted me to Thunder Wave. So, so that's a good play on his part. I go to Hipster, set up my Sand Stream. She goes for the knockoff. Tries to knock on my leftovers on Hipster, which that doesn't matter. Goes back to Run on Wash, think, predicting um, a ground move. And here, I just switch out, predicting a special attacking move. But he goes for a will wisp trying to burn my hipster. As, uh, like I said before, there's no um, ground type move. So he just goes for a hydro pump. And I've already seen almost his whole moveset. And I don't know what's his last move. And all that. He goes for a hydro pump. Does not do any damage to me. Seismic toss. Almost 3 hit KOs. As his reflect goes off, I thought he was gonna set up another reflect, so he goes for paint split, and I'm here like, wait, he does not have an electric type move, so my Gyarados can run house, but then I almost forgot that 
that's a water type and that water, water types do wall me of the Gyarados so I have to get rid of this thing as soon as possible so I just go for a seismic toss um, just uh, trying to do the damage he goes off to Fuego and I saw for it just to heal um, and even my HP as high as possible and here I switched predicting like um, a steel type move for the punch but he goes for U-turn predicting me and then he goes to um on. here I thought Glaciate will do a lot of damage but I see saw that was a crit but that still didn't kill, do enough to kill alright now I go back to Hipster uh, he goes off to um, his Rorizion I just toxic it um because I just want to toxic the Trigon as I have no way of attacking but to stall. Which that sucks but yeah. I sack off here just for health. He does I icicle spear, I'm here like wait <sighs> I wanted to live and I just go for toxic. Um the reflect fire war off as he switches, seeing that I that did nothing, and I just stack off my health back to full. And he will a wisp here, and uh, that doesn't matter because um, I'm not have any physical moves. But I missed the toxic, which really sucks. He pain spits as he find as he heals a lot of damage. I just roar. He goes out to Verizion. And uh, let's see what he does. He leaf blades right off the bat. I just live at one percent, and I heal, which is a good thing. Um, I switch. I go to Gyarados, and this is kind of where it begins. Look at that. That did nothing to it, Gyarados. Now, Verizon can do much damage to me. As he goes to patch out, I find out that's unaware. And I I just get scared right here. Because I'm not sure what to do against this thing. But I do go for substitute, predicting like a status move. But he goes for aroma therapy. Good plan on his part. Just so he could heal off the toxic damage. I just waterfall here. And this is where it begins. He flinches once. That's a 10% chance to flinch. It's not my fault that I flinched. I just go for it again because I saw the damage and then he flinched again this actually causes him the match and I feel really bad um just for that um I just waterfall just for damage but I feel bad for his patch up um he got flinched twice which cost him the game goes for my machine I go for waterfall, complete destroyed. I don't know what set he runs on that metal swan. Now this is so key right now, cause I just set up dragon dance, cause I can't do anything to this thing. I find out he's light clay. He cannot paint spit me. He can't touch me. All he has is hydro pump. Um, I just set up another dragon dance, just to be a plus three. I try to set up because I roll him wash cannot touch me with that set. I just destroy him with the nice fang. That ice fang comes in clutch. Um, he goes off to scissor. I thought he, well, because the reflect is up, he just knocks off my item. Now I just um he, he appear, I think he sacked off his um scissor. And he's gotta go got a water. I actually predict the will o wisp. He cannot touch. Look at that. I predict the will o wisp, which is why I have substitute in the first place. Um The Waterfall plus three still did no damage. But I'm not banking on any hacks. I just wanna win legit and then here I got a crit. That crit kinda mattered in the long run 
And then he um loses his patch right here. And my Gyarados got a a five oh win for me, killed all of his Pokemon. And everybody was surprised in the chat of how I won. They saw they saw I did hacks. I won by hacks. Did not anticipate it for to be hacks. Did not want hacks. But I got it anyways. Those ten percent flinches costed Roshi the game. Luckily me and Roshi are still really good friends because it's showdown. It was showdown that did it, not me. And um yeah, I won I now have a two win streak with a differential of seven. Um good job Roshi, you played well. I'm sorry for the flinch. And uh I hope the rest of the season goes well for you man. I'm glad we're still friends. And uh I hope you all have a nice day. And you too, Roshi. Everybody have a nice day. Bye-bye.